Welcome to Northern Illinois. Welcome to the video. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog and welcome back to another Northern Illinois winter. Okay guys, welcome back to another winter in Northern Illinois. I want to do an update video on my Ryobi snow shovel because that video, my previous video, got crazy amount of views. I want to thank all you guys for those views. All you guys that left the comments, thank you so much for those comments. I tried to get back to you guys as often as I could, but because of those questions and comments, I decided to make an update video to kind of illustrate the point of this power shovel. First off, a lot of you guys said, wouldn't it make more sense just to go ahead and get a snow blower? I have a snow blower. Snow blower is great for the driveway. <laughs> Basically, I picked up that power shovel because it was 40 bucks and I knew it was a good way to get my kids out here to help me, but it's not for a driveway. That's what a snow blower is for. And the second most common question I got was how is it in deep wet snow well we finally got some deep snow we got five to seven inches last night which for a lot of you people especially you guys up in canada that's not a lot but down here in northern illinois that's a good amount of snow so what we're going to do now is i'm going to take the power shovel over to the sidewalk and i'm going to show you how it works in deep snow okay guys so the one thing that i want to say about this after using it for a season is it doesn't have a directional shoot. I can't turn it right or left. It's not as convenient as a snow thrower or a snow blower. So you really have to pay attention to where you're shooting it. And hey, on windy days, you're gonna wear most of it. Let's see how it does. what I'm talking about you see me just shooting it at the house so basically I'm building up more snow that direction so you really want to plan how you're gonna remove the snow with this thing So to answer the question, how is it in deep snow? It's not the greatest, but it will work. Like I said before in the previous video, I don't recommend using it in this manner if you want it to last. This was never intended to replace your snow thrower or your snow blower. It was just intended to be an aid to your snow removal arsenal. I still stand behind what I said in the previous video. If this was a battery operated snow shovel, it would cost probably 10 times more than the $40 I paid for. Having a cord on it is not ideal, but it gets the job done. Okay, so to reiterate, do I think this thing is built for heavy snowfalls? no it's not i mean yeah i could you saw i cleared this path here and it's more than the size of the snow shovel itself it's probably not a good idea to continually do that it's not made for snow that heavy or that thick but it will clear it and yes as you can tell 
I'm still going to get a broom or a shovel and get that little mess cleaned off there. It's not really designed to do that either. But like I said, is it easier to do it and quicker to do it with a shovel? Hey, maybe if you're 20 years old and you're built like a Greek god, but... Okay, so let me make one small correction. If you're an elderly woman or an elderly man and you got this much snowfall, you're probably not going to want to dig this thing out and clear your walkway anyways. That's when you're going to want to lean on your family and friends for help. Let's face it, this thing isn't designed for snow this heavy and if you're that elderly, you probably should get help anyways. But will it clear heavy snow? It sure will and for 40 bucks did I go wrong with it? I still don't think it was a bad buy, not for 40 bucks. Hey, you guys still here? Hey, real quick, before I let this video end, I just wanted to make the point that this power shovel only cost me $40. So I was really just trying to compare to see if that $40 investment was worth it. I never intended to actually pit this power shovel against an actual snowblower. So I know I confused a lot of people with that, but please keep that in mind. This really isn't to replace your snowblower. It's just to help you out, you know, maybe get the kids a little active. That's that's pretty much it. Oh, and, 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 and real quick, real quick, one more thing, one more thing. I get a lot of comments from people saying, oh, you're the guy who blows your snow in the road. Hey, man, between me and you, um, I cleaned all that up. I just didn't put it in the video because I wouldn't want to watch that, would you? <laughs> Truthfully, I didn't cut all of that out of the video because... I'm not going to watch somebody clean the snow out of the road, but I assure you that I'm not that guy. So rest easy. Until next time, guys, like, subscribe. I'll see you next video.